Uh, my name is Danny Deliberto, founder of Ladles of Love. It was founded back in 2014. The communities we, s we work with are all over the peninsula and um, we're working with 138 beneficiaries now. We've grown exponentially. Um, we've been able to do that because of all the kindness that we have experienced um, from individuals and corporates such as uh, Interbet who just want to be part of the change. Race 7 is the Greyville Convention Centre MR67 Apprentice Handicap. Once again, over the minimum trip of 1,000 metres. The race due off at 10 past 4. We have 9 runners carded. Doesn't make it any easier that it's a smallish field. The early favourite is number 7, Pacific Winter, at 3 to 1. They're betting 4 to 1 about Michael Roberts' runner. Number 2, Let's Get Together. And then uh, 5, 6 and 7 to 1, a whole host of runners. Sheldon. This race is ripe for an upset, I think. If you've had the courage to bank her magically, um, then my suggestion would be to go the field and look for a result here. That said, Pacific Winter does appear to set the standard. He does appear to bring the right form into the race. Um, one of my horses to watch out for is Com Naidu's new acquisition, number one, Edward Longshanks. Com Stable, we've said it earlier, is in terrific form. He gets his horse from the high felt. First run in KZN, first run on the poly track, drawn in gate one, could be anything in this class of race. So he's one of my horses to watch out for. But if you start to look beyond Pacific Winter, then you've got to go the whole lot, in I my agree. opinion. I agree with you. You have to go with the field and hopefully for the longer price runner. But I'll be in the camp of number one, Edward Longshanks, Comnard in tremendous form. And if you go back to the 17th of February in a progress plate, the average rating was an 86. He ran second to It's About Time. He showed a lot of promise earlier on, but he hasn't delivered on that. He's still a one-time winner. But we've seen Kom Nadu bring the horses down to KZN, and all of a sudden the change of surroundings and a few different things, and bang, they're back into the winner's enclosure. He's got the best of the draw. He's a thousand meter horse on this occasion. He did win earlier on over a different distance, but I think he's going to go very, very well at around seven to one. Pacific Winter, probably the horse they all have to beat on form, and then number four, Bless Me Fred. But when you dissect the field, it's very, very tricky. Caden Brewer rides Edward Longshanks for Com Naidu, and the combination healthy strike rate, 15% win strike rate, uh, 61 times they've uh, joined forces for nine victories. That's a good strike rate. And we haven't seen much of Caden Brewer up here in KZN recently, but he's a talented rider, he's lost his claim, and uh, he's gone through the, the, you know, the ranks very quickly. Edward Longshanks, obviously the fact that he's drawn one is in his favor. Pacific Winter, smallish field, but nonetheless a wideish draw of seven. Uh, but he likes to sit in just behind them. So it's a trappy race. Pacific winter, we both agree. Sheldon and I set the standard. We both picked up on the same horse to watch out for, Edward Longshanks. Once you start going beyond that, it becomes a bit of a minefield. So if you're not in the camp of Pacific winter and Edward Longshanks, then I suggest you've got to go them all, particularly if you've had the courage and got away with bankering magically in the previous. Hi, I'm Trevor, the CEO of the SAME Foundation. The donation we received from Interbase helped us in procuring vital, life-saving medical equipment and PPE for Tigerberg and Huitiskia hospitals in the Western Cape. Um, this was while the Western Cape was the epicenter of the pandemic. If you'd like to get in touch or assist us in these projects, you can get hold of us on our website, which is www.samefoundation.org.za, Facebook and Instagram or LinkedIn.